edition of this conference, which takes place every year alongside the conference of the party, the COPS, that is now taking place these two weeks in, in Madrid. Three partners or stakeholders are together to promote this space of dialogue between the World Business Council, the local governments, ICLAI, and the academia, represented by SDSN. This conference uh, this year is also co-organized with the Politecnica University and another university in Chile, the PUC, the Pontificia University. Mm -hmm. the, uh, the Spanish uh, uh, chapter of the SDSN is obviously having an, an important role today here and these two days in the conference. The outcomes of these uh, discussions about research gaps and technical solutions for a decarbonized economy, hopefully, and we will try to make it happen, will be fed into the political agenda and discussed in the COP these days. So before starting with the first session, let us uh, introduce some logistical arrangements or housekeeping uh, issues. First, there's not going to be a printed program because we try to avoid as much as possible uh, unnecessary printing. So you have in the main door, there is a card with the full program and you can also follow the program in the website of the event. It's available there. Uh, second, there would be two-way translation available, so if you need a pair of handsets uh, for translation, both uh, from Spanish to English or English to Spanish, please uh, do not hesitate in, in taking that. And of course, there is Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi available. You can have the passwords and the data on the, on the walls. And remember that we will be using uh, Twitter all day long and uh, all, all along the conference, and the hashtag is systems transformation. Thank you. Okay. So the overview of the program is that we will have one day and a half ahead. And uh, we're going to have, uh, before the coffee break, uh, two uh, scene uh, setting uh, sessions. And then later on, four technical panels on low, low carbon power, transport, and next, uh, industrial processes and cities. And tomorrow, we will continue with uh, the solutions, uh, uh, how they can be implemented in, in practice. So let's start with the first session of the, this intense morning, which is the formal opening of the conference and two opening sessions or keynotes. First, Rector Cisneros from Politecnica University will provide us with the welcome remarks and the general introductory words. Guillermo Cisneros is full professor at the School of Telecommunications Engineering. He has been dean of the school, president of the board of the deans of telecom engineering schools in, in Spain, and executive director of the foundation Universidad.es. Since 2016, he is the rector of Universidad Politecnica de Madrid. So the first uh, keynote would be by uh, Minister uh, Juan Carlos Llobet. Uh, he's the Minister of Energy in the Government of Chile, and he has a degree in Business and Economics from Pontificia Universidad Católica de Chile, an MBA and, and a Master in Public Administration from Harvard University. He has held uh, several positions in the first uh, Piñera administration, uh, where he became Minister of Labor and Social Welfare in 2013. And this June 2019, he was appointed as uh, Minister of Energy in Chile with the mandate of uh, transforming the energy matrix in the country to a greener, more decarbonized uh, system, and also trying to put the country in the path of uh, being neutral in CO2 emissions. And finally, the second keynote will be delivered by Professor Sachs, Director of the United Nations Sustainable Developmental Solution Networks. Jeffrey Sachs is world-renowned full professor of economics affiliated to Columbia University, where he serves as the director of the Center for Sustainable Development. He's a leader in sustainable development and has been a senior advisor to several United Nations Secretary Generals on the Sustainable Developmental Goals and Millennium Developmental Goals, Antonio, Antonio Gutierrez, and previously Ban Ki-moon and Kofi Annan. Under the auspices of United Nations, he serves as director of SDSN. He's the author of several bestsellers, and most of you know probably The End of Poverty, and writes a monthly newspaper column appearing in more than 100 countries. 
So we already have the three speakers on stage. I will leave the floor to Rector Cisneros to open the session. Next, we will have the two keynotes by Minister Jovet and Professor Sachs. And finally, Professor Cisneros will uh, close and present the UPM uh, contribution. So thank you very much. Thank you. Well, thank you very much. As a Rector of Universidad Politécnica de Madrid, I would like to welcome you, everybody, to our university, and particularly to our School of Industrial Engineers. And given the fact that I will, I will come back to you after, uh, at, at the end of the session, and given the fact that uh, the Dean of the school is here, I would like to invite him to provide all of you the welcome remarks. Please, uh, Professor Garcia Suarez, Oscar, dear Oscar, is your, the floor is yours. Thank you very much, uh, dear Rector, dear Ministry of Energy of Chile, dear Professor Sachs. Uh, welcome everyone to this School of Industrial Engineering and the, to our University, Universidad Politécnica Madrid. We are, I should say that we are very glad of hosting this uh, important conference here, and to be honest, of course, uh, one month ago we didn't know we are going to organize this here. So it has been a very tough work, uh, but we are here. So thank you to all of you, to, uh, to all the attendees for being here. And in particular, I should give thank you to a few people that m make this possible. I will give their names now because I should do it. First one is Ruth Carrasco. Um, Ruth is a, a professor here in, the, in this school. She's, she's uh, doing a very nice uh, job. Uh, Carlos Matais. Carlos, where are you? Thank you, Carlos, for all your support. Alberto Garrido, my director. Uh, you're doing a very great job as well. So I hope you will be here for 1.5 days. I hope you find everything in their position. So if you need anything else, please let us know. And in addition to that, I should say that I have to Thank you all our staff, because in other case it would not be possible, and all of the volunteers that we have in this school. So hopefully you have a very nice conference today, and this is all. Thank you very much.